Welcome everybody to another Transformers review. Today we'll be reviewing Transformers Alpha the Cetacons Alita 1. Yeah, here she is in her motorcycle mode. Now, uh, she is a straight on repaint of uh, Chromia. Now, which uh, makes makes sense to me since both Chromia and Alita 1 are supposed to be sist uh, twin sisters in, in the movie. And, uh, she, uh, the motorcycle has all kinds of good detail. Got uh, nice uh, uh, blue transverse headlights, which I do think they have light by me in them, but they don't actually work, unfortunately. Yeah, they, uh, they got uh, they got nice uh, uh, detail on the wheels. I do look, and you look closely, you can see a little uh, fuel pump. You know, a little air, a little air pump in the on the tires, which is a very nice uh, detail feature. Yeah, uh, uh, nice detail on the on the back wheels, and you can clear. You turn it on the other side, you could clearly see. Yeah, you can see you can see uh, the uh, bike chains. Yeah, yeah, which is a uh, very, uh, very cool. Yeah, the little one has uh, all kinds of uh, alien tattoos on her, on her body. Got or alien tattoos on the sides, sides right here. Or, and then and another tattoo on uh, the rear seat. Yeah, that uh, that is a uh, very, yeah, not only a nice. Uh, uh, chrome detail uh, uh, on the engine. Although that's not metal, it's uh, all plastic. But yeah, the way the way they uh, painted is all chrome. Looks like it's chromed. Yeah, a very a very well painted uh, uh, figure. Yeah, that's what. Yeah, yeah. She just uh, she just come. Yeah, uh, one of the biggest gripes uh, that she had uh, a lot more motorcycles that she uh, had. Alia was is severely out of scale, uh, which she is. If you compare her to uh, uh, Bumblebee, she is uh, way too big to be a scale. Uh, in fact, in fact, if you would compare her to. Uh, no, uh, to watch it. Yeah, Alita One's almost the uh, same size as a Voyager, which is now uh, not the way, uh, not the way, to, the way it should uh, should be. Yeah, clear. Uh, clearly, she uh, clearly she doesn't. Uh, she's not on scale with the other uh, Autobot vehicles. <sighs> Uh, Elite, mm, Elite One does come with a does come with a stand. Yeah, does uh, does come with a stand, wh uh, which has yeah details of mm, other machine guns and the laser and the laser gun. The other they can yeah uh, be uh, yeah, you can atta uh, attach this to the back. So. You know, weaponize uh, uh, her in, uh, in more like a mode, give her some guns to shoot at. Uh, or uh, you can use a display stand for uh, if you want, if you choose to display a Leo one in a more like a mode. Although she does, uh, she does uh, come with a little kickstand, uh, but it's very, it's very tricky to get her to stand up. So yeah, this is a you know. What I'm gonna do is set, let's set this motorcycle on a stand like this, and you can uh, create all kinds of uh, good action poses. Mm. Yeah, to have on your uh, to have your have on your shelf. Yeah, so transformation for uh, Leo One is very unique uh, and very and very satisfying. Yeah, uh, first you want to do is uh, 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 turn up the size of the fuel tank, 
which forms the Lee One soldiers, then uh, uh, shoulder pads. Then you want to flip up the seat right here. Then you want to want to do is uh, peg this. This becomes her arm. Uh, you want to peg the seat. Yeah, I'll uh, flip on the license plate. It does. Uh, it does have a, a detailed license plate. Uh, uh, three one one seven four, which yeah spells Alita one. If you think about it, yeah, I forgot to show uh show that earlier. But anyway, you want to flip it. Uh, flip this down. Okay, you want to. Uh, what you want to do is turn, uh, twist this whole assembly. Now they're mm, sticking out, uh, so they're sticking out like so. Do the same thing. I just want to pull this out. Pull this wheel. You want to rotate this around. Yeah, like so. Yeah, then you want to do is uh, uh, take the motorcycle. Uh, no, take these handlebars. No, no. Uh, turn it forward uh, like this, and, ro uh, and rotate this. Uh, no, the handle, uh, the handlebar around. Then you want to do is uh, flip. There, uh, there's a uh, little one's head. So you want to flip this up. Yeah, then attach the and attach the the box. The other ones, yeah, body together. Uh. Now you want uh, now you got the body done. Yeah, you, uh, you, now you want to bend this down. So, then you want to do is flip, uh, flip the bike wheel, yeah, you know, down like this. Then you want to fold the body so it looks more, uh, it looks more solid. At least that's why the way I do it. Yeah, on the, on this arm, uh, for. No, for this you want to uh, fold down the wheel like so, and you know, place the handle seats to make up her uh, unicycle leg. Yeah, here's an, uh, on the other side is. Definitely, this is becoming the dawn arm, so. Put this down, and then you got. And you want to extend this. Do you want to. Yeah, flip it down like that. Uh, flip it on like that. And there you have Alita One in her uh, unicycle mode, uh, in her robot mode. Uh, uh, as you see, I can't uh, stand her up because she has a, a wheel at the bottom. And the butt. Th uh, thankfully, we, we got a stand to put her in. So we want to put. Uh, so we want to do is uh, attach you know, these two onto the uh, on the axle on the screw of the Alita One. Yeah, try it. And there. And while she's on, she is. You know, she stands there for Casaldi. And there, uh, there you have Alita One in her uh, uh, robot mode. Well, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, very strange, but yeah, I, I like it. 
I do, I do, lo- I do like the fact that uh, Leo Wan has this uh, huge, uh, uh, big can arm uh, 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 for an arm. Uh, yeah, which it, uh, it does have a missile, which you can't fire. I so fires a, a blue tra- uh, translucent missile. Yeah. Yeah, I, I just love the way how unique the robot mode looks. I mean, uh, I mean, it's a nice change from the usual uh, the humanoid transformers. I mean, certainly she's uh, very alien looking. Yeah, I mean, she's got. Uh, I mean, she looks weird with all uh, D shape, but you know uh, that uh, that makes her uh, alien. You know, the uh, movie Transformer, Michael Bay wanted to uh, remove uh, uh, the Transformers' uh, uh, human-like looks to make them more uh, alien. You know, and I love, uh, and I love, and I love it a lot. You know? Oh yeah, I forgot to. Uh... Yeah, sorry, I forgot to. Uh... Flip the engine to reveal her hand, but but yeah, she she is unique. Uh, 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 it's kind of it's it's a shame you have to use a stand to the standard up in, but heck, I think it's a, I think th- uh, I think that's better. Uh, I think that's better. Uh, I kind of I kind of wish that the uh, Hasbro would have made uh, such a stand for Demolisher. Uh, for his uh, robot mode, you know, so uh, we can uh, at least, hmm. uh, at least we could, uh, at least we can have be fr- be freeing uh, Demolisher's arms from our from our poses and give him uh, a nice uh, uh, unicycle look. Uh, I know there's uh, uh, some reason later one does have this. If you flip this up. Monster yeah, yeah, he's got, yeah, he got the little piece which has a slot attached, which is ca- uh, causing a lot, of, a lot of rumors where, uh, where if you get, uh, they get, if you get RC, uh, it's allowed, uh, RC, Chrome and Leo One all uh, combined into uh, a giant robot. Not, yeah, uh, really, that's just a rumor. I mean, there was there was such a, a robot, and uh, Hasbro would uh, would have been releasing instructions on how and uh, how to do it. You know, and that and that's gonna yeah, that's gonna me- uh, make them money, make them make people buy the uh, buy the toys, and yeah, they uh, they will. Uh, if there was such a combined mode, Hasbro will definitely uh, yeah, put out instructions. Yeah, showing you how uh, how to do it, uh, but yeah, there are no such such instructions. So basically, they're not. Uh, there's no combined mode. Uh, sorry about that, guys. But I do think they are meant to mm, attach one another since you know, in, uh, in the movie uh, they show a lot of uh, acrobatic moves. So perhaps. Uh, you are gonna attach mm, you know, RC on the back of Alita One or Chromia. You know, make him look, uh, make him like a nice you know, action pose, or you know, two, one sister jumping on a sister's back, uh, uh, shooting Decepticons. Well, yeah, <sighs> yeah, but uh, yeah, my fun. Fi- uh, yeah, for a size comparison, robot mode is here. Here, here she is next to uh, uh, Ravage. Yeah. See, she's a tall figure. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, if you see, if you see Alia One in stars, please pick her up. I mean, she's in the movie, so uh, don't pass her up. Yeah. This is my review on Transformers: Hunt for the Decepticons, Alia One. Hell, thank you for watching. Goodbye.